I wanted students to know how powerful and helpful Notion AI is. So what I did was I directly asked Notion AI to tell me its strengths. And there we go. AI says you can use it for idea generation, insight discovery, flexible thinking, and so much of all this. What I did here is a prime example of an AI tool that is enhancing the experience in every possible way. So in this video, I want to focus on writing with Notion AI. For students, this could be a game changer. See this as your guide to writing better. Notion AI has the option for you to not only help you write, but also edit and improve your writing. So let's explore. But first, those who are new, let me tell you what Notion is. Notion is a note-taking app that you can start using for free. With its 4 million users, it is creating a boom in the productivity and note-taking field. You can create pages and within pages, there could be databases and the databases can be in the format of tables, Kanban boards, lists. And then you can also link multiple pages together, add web links, files, PDFs, and so much more. Learning Notion would be a whole new series that one can work on. I would recommend you to go to Thomas Frank, who is explaining Notion super well and updating you about every new thing that's coming in this app. More on that later. Let's go back to writing and improving your writing using Notion AI. Let's talk about the writing options first. Let's zoom here and see what you can do. All right, here we are. This is a whole new page. Press space for AI. So here we go. And you see, if we have to start writing, we can draft with AI. We can write blog posts, social media posts, outline, essays, let's see more here. You can have poems written, to-do lists, pros and cons, sales, email, job description, anything. Then you can also have summary and there are action items. All right, let's do a quick example. Tell me the pros and cons of studying in the USA. There you go. The Notion AI has now generated a very well elaborated form. And you see how the format is. There is a heading and then there is description afterwards. If you have an assignment that you want to work on, you can use Notion AI and create a draft. But mind you, you do not have to copy paste the whole thing. Read it. It will help you brainstorm further ideas, then improve on it, and then use your own words into it. You need to edit it as well. Just do not copy paste. I would not recommend this. This was the writing part. Now comes the editing. So let's assume this pros and cons list is something that I created and I want to improve this. We highlight the section that we want to improve. We're going to ask AI and then you see here the options of editing and reviewing. We can improve the writing. It will rewrite for you and rephrase the whole paragraph. You can check for spellings and grammar. You can make the passage shorter or you can make the passage longer for further information. You can change the tone. You can simplify language. You can translate. You can get explanation. So let's explore one by one. Let's say if I want to make these two points longer. It's going to start writing and it's going to give me a longer passage and then I will have the information to either replace the selection or continue writing, make it longer, try again. So let's say replace the selection. So I've changed from what it was previously. All right, let's try another editing option here. I'm going to highlight point three again and I'm going to ask AI to change the tone to let's say friendly. This way it's going to just rephrase the whole passage and make it in a more friendly tone. Isn't this amazing? This changing the tone would be very helpful in writing your emails, in writing let's say a greeting card to a friend and you can just switch between being professional and being casual. If you want to keep it, we replace it or we can insert below so we can have the new one as well as the previous one. Another feature I want to show is summarizing. So I'm going to highlight this and I'm going to ask AI to summarize this for me. And it just has given me all four points in three lines. This will be super helpful if you have a lot of reading to do and you don't have time. So you get it here and then you ask AI to summarize this. This was a very brief introduction to Notion AI and how a student can use it for writing and editing and reviewing. Sign up for Notion and then tell me if you want me to dive deeper and then give you more videos on how to work around Notion, how to plan your day in Notion, how to make your goals and planner and all that. And I would be happy to do in the next videos.